everyone welcome back to my channel in this video like the title says i'm sharing with you my favorites now these favorites were stuff that i've been using for the last couple months or well i was not using a lot of makeup for the last couple of months because i was not well but i recently started wearing makeup on even in occasions when i had to go out these were the products that i gravitated to and i'm excited to share them with you let's get started I have not been using a lot of foundation, but I noticed that when I do, I'm grabbing my Maybelline Fit Me. And recently, my sister asked me, what is my favorite foundation? I said, you know, I really like the Fit Me, um, which is the Matte and Poreless. I've really, really enjoyed using this. And I'm using shade 320, which is natural tan. And I am wearing it right now. I pulled this out a couple weeks, maybe two to three weeks ago, and this is the e.l.f. Tone Correcting um, Powder in Warm. I've had this forever in my collection, and my powder was finishing, and I was just looking for something. Pulled it out and realized I really liked it. I think it's just so light. I don't know if there's anything in particular that it's doing in terms of tone correcting, but I just seem to like it because it's light, and it doesn't change really the color of my foundation still playing around with it um, if you guys use this let me know what your thoughts are on it i pulled out this sleek um blush by three palette uh, because i was looking for more um orange tone since we're in fall here and i this one is take a cheeky peek and this is what it looks like I don't know if you guys can see it. There's a shimmer. This like shimmer, matte, and like a satin color. I generally use the shimmer one sometimes or the satin um, just to get a nice orangey look if I'm used, doing anything like an orange lip or gold color tones on my eyes. And I pulled out this Sasha Intense Matte Lip Velvet in Big Girl Now. And I use this quite a lot, especially when I wear that particular... Um, uses these blushes and it goes really well with this one in the middle I know this the, can you guys see yeah the light is be in behind my iPad then I have a couple lip products because a lot of times when I was not able to put on makeup and anything lip lip products were the thing I would wear then I have this Jeffree Star and Gemini it's like a nude color Yes, it's finishing because I was killing it. Pulled out my Up The Amp, which I've had forever. Still smells very vanilla but I want to use it up. I don't know if I could use it up by the end of the year, but I want to use this up because it's I've had it forever and I love it. And you know, before I was so much into purple lips and now I've like toned down so much. Then I my last lip product is this... Um, I think these were from Bottom Body Works. This is Lip Licious Best Kiss. And this is what it looks like. I've had this also forever. It's a sheer lip gloss that turns pink on lips. It's super beautiful. Really nice. Gives you a nice sheer. A lot of times I will just put it on if I have to really go anywhere. And it just will brighten up my face. And I think that's why I gravitated to using it so much. Two eyeshadow palettes and super inexpensive eyeshadow palettes. First is this Profusion Warm Glam eyeshadow palette. And I initially thought I uploaded my review on this palette only to realize that I didn't. So I'm not sure if that video is going to be up before this favorite video, which will be my September favorites. If it's not up as yet, then it's going to definitely come right after this video. And I just love these colors all together. You can see they're like fall colors, so they're beautiful. And then the other palette is this one called Pumpkin Pie from e.l.f. So this palette is actually 5 US and this e.l.f. palette is 3 US and it has four eyeshadows. And you can see the wear especially on this color here because I have used it a ton and they're really, really pigmented. For body stuff, I've been loving my pumpkin latte. Love this. Um, I'm here. And I just started it using it, you know, maybe a week, about two to three weeks. But I love, 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 love this. Um, I got this last year from Bath & Body Works. Ugh, I have to go and see what scents they have now. 
and I have a review on a scent that I will share with you guys. And my last favorite is this pen from Jordan. I've been journaling a lot recently since I was going through a lot of stuff. A friend recommended I start journaling and Jordan saw me doing a lot of writing. We went out to a store and he snugged this in the cart. My husband paid for it. And when I came home, he was like, you know, like how random, why was this? And, and then Jordan said, he's surprised, you know, so sweet. He said, that's a surprise to mama for when she writes in her book, all her thoughts in her book. So yeah, it's definitely a favorite. So cute. It was it's so cheerful. Um, but I think it's, I appreciate the tort. The tort is really, really, really what um, makes it. That's my current favorite. Um, those are the products I've been enjoying. Let me know what some of your favorites are. I am not buying any new makeup. My goal right now, more or less, is to go through my stuff. Even though if I may go somewhere and I see something like I did recently, I will pick it up, but I'm not looking to spend a lot of money. So you may see as I do videos, as I get time, that I will go through like old makeup and just try to use up products I already have in my collection. Hope you guys are doing great and would love to hear from you. So leave your comments in the section, in the comment section below. Let me know what products you're loving and hope to hear from you guys soon. Until my next video. Bye-bye.